Brightstone helps adults living with developmental disabilities by providing for their total life needs in a God-centered caring environment. Through private donations, they are able to meet the needs of many in the Nashville community. Trace Adkins recently signed on as the headliner for Brightstone's annual Songwriters Night to help raise funds for their organization. Kelly Lynn caught up with a few people that made the evening a tremendous success. I'm here with Trace Adkins at the Brightstone event. Now this is like your third time doing this, isn't it? I think this is my third time actually, yeah. I, um, I, I usually take a year off in between times, so uh, yeah, this is my third time. What brings you back every year? I know this is such a great cause. The money that is raised goes for such a great... And all that's true. Brightstone is, is uh, you know, the, the, service, the service that they provide, and they're just wonderful people. But for me, it's as simple as uh, Craig Farrell. Uh, Craig Farrell is a friend of mine. He's been a friend of mine for many, many years, and I love the man. He's fixed everything that I've broken on my body. He's one of the finest orthopedic surgeons in this country, and when Craig Farrell calls me and asks me if I would do something, then I do it. I don't even ask him what it's about or why. And, um, and I know his son John, um, known him forever, and John always picks at me, and, and John is a student at Brightstone, and John always picks at me. I, I'll, I'll ask him, and if I asked him right now, I'd say, John, who's your favorite country singer? He'll say, Toby Keith. <laughs> and he's just picking at me, you know, but I, I love Craig and John, and you know, they want me to do something for them, then I'm, I'll do it. So baby, if you want, you can sing along. But this ain't no love song. What are you going to sing tonight? How long are you going to be up there? Uh, I don't know how long I'll be up there. I'll, I'll try to sing a couple of hits, I guess, and maybe a couple of things I wrote. And, but the, the people I have with me tonight, though, I brought a stellar crew tonight. Uh, these guys are truly legends, and they're iconic, and some of the songs they've written are some of the biggest songs in music history. I, I've got uh, Sonny Lemaire and J.P. Pennington from Exile, Jimmy Fortune from the Statler Brothers, and, and Jimmy's going to do some songs tonight that people are going to go, oh my God, he wrote that. So, And then Chris Wallen is here tonight with me, and he's written several things that I've recorded, and Chris has written some big, big songs. And So I've got a great crew with me tonight, so I'm just going to try to stay out of the way, sing bass for him on some stuff. That's what I'm going to do. I know he meant well. But all I can do I'm here with Brenda Hawk, the executive director of Brightstone. How are you? Fine, thank you. I'm sure you're very pleased tonight with the outcome and all the people who bought tickets to come out and support such a great cause. You know, it's amazing. We always call this a magical evening, and it certainly is. We're very blessed to have this community support Brightstone in this huge way. No, I think I read that maybe $100,000 is being raised tonight. We're trying. We're trying for that. We're actually trying to outdo our golf benefit. It raised 100000 so we really need this for these special adults. Yes, and tell us for the viewers and the people in the community about Brightstone and what it does. We are a right now a job training school for adults who are developmentally and physically disabled. Brightstone gives them a place to come, a place to be every day safe. We have a full-time nurse on duty. We have occupational therapy and recreation therapy, and we provide job training services as well as fun classes, just classes that you and I might have an opportunity to take in life, like computer or art and crafts. And we take them into the community to go to the library or to go bowling, just to have a good time as adults and be a part of this Middle Tennessee community. We service five counties oh. in the Middle Tennessee area coming to us. And this is a program very much needed. And we just want to thank this community for supporting Brightstone in such a huge way. It's just been, it's been amazing, this support. And we're looking forward now to the next phase of Brightstone because we're going to be building a community of homes where they can have assisted living oh, in a protected and secure environment, which is what their parents really are worried about. They're concerned about what's going to happen when to that gone. adult when they're gone. And right now our oldest adult is nearing 60, and this is a viable concern. So we hope Brightston will be one of the solutions for these families. That's not all the music we have in this week's show. We've got a talented young actress who is making a name for herself in the country music community. We'll be back right after this. 